Bob is a true icon of Tampa. I can't think of anyone more representative of what the culture is of, of Tampa, born and raised in this city, has been involved in his business, currently president where he's been for multiple years, but over 63 years of his personal involvement in it. Plus he's given back tremendously to the community. He is an amazing businessman, joined his family's business, his father's business when he was only 12 years old, joined it immediately and became a leader right then and there. When you look at the list of projects that he's accomplished, it's mind blowing. He is a hard worker up early in the morning. People are familiar with some of his projects, especially that dome over at the entrance to Epcot. He's also built bridges around this country and roads and buildings here in Tampa as well. Bob has been such a corporate business leader in our town, as well as a philanthropist and supporter of many different issues in the community that I think uh, he's being recognized for the things he does business-wise, as well as what he does for our community in a caring fashion. Many people are familiar with his famous Friday luncheons, but in addition to inviting people to luncheons, he also hosts tables for a lot of the not-for-profit groups in the Tampa Bay area. So he is very, very generous. He truly does want to do things with his support and his involvement that are helping people who aren't able to help themselves. And he does it very quietly. He does it because he wants an impact, not because he wants glory. The other attribute that I think is worthy of mentioning besides Bob's phenomenal success in business has been his sponsorship of the Miss Tampa pageant. And it's not a beauty pageant, it's truly a talent pageant. He's done this for 20 odd years and uh, is the executive director and the primary financial sponsor of this organization. And many of the women that have gone on through this have been Miss Florida and gone on to very successful business careers. Bob is just an all around great guy. The minute you meet him, he is so engaging. He is funny, he has got the sweetest heart, and he's a very wise businessman. It's almost impossible not to love Bob. Bob, congratulations on this honor. It's really not a surprise that you'll be recognized. I'm proud to have your involvement at the Tampa Bay Chamber, but more importantly, I'm very proud that I get to call you my friend. Congratulations. Bob, congratulations, long overdue. I couldn't think of anybody more deserving for this award and welcome to the Business Hall of Fame. Bob, congratulations on this most important award. I know you've received a lot of other recognitions, but this is a high point and it means a lot to you and to our community. I can't imagine anyone more deserving to be inducted into the Tampa Bay Business Hall of Fame. What you've accomplished professionally, what you've accomplished in our community, I am so grateful for you and what you have done for me. Congratulations, I love you my friend.